Uh, I'm still worried about how it's going to piece together. I was expecting zero. For just, I didn't think it was going to be interesting at all. But we, we, going over it, well, what little I did because you did all the work, uh, seems fairly interesting. Inside Production Company. Whoosh. A mind that's weak and a back that's strong. You load 16 tons. What do you get? Another day older and deeper in debt. St. Peter, don't you call me cause I can't go. I owe my soul to the company store. I, 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 I. Uh, with Inside Company? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And I can't wait. I can't wait for this whole experience to unravel. I'm, there's people shooting outside right now, and everybody's so amazing, and everybody is so friendly and awesome. I'm, I'm so happy. I'm so happy to be here. I think there is a mutual dishonesty between producers and those involved. I don't feel like I really know what's going on, other than them saying, hey, um, come here and do this, and now we're doing this, and you're just kind of like, oh, uh, okay. So you can like figure out what you want to do, get comfortable, press record. I'm still kind of figuring out what's going on here. Like, what the hell is going on again? Um, so, you truly know nothing about the Inside Company and what we do? Not really. I'll explain it to you. <laughs> They're pretty much signing away kind of their reputation. At yeah, that point. fuck you. Yeah, I mean, okay, yeah, make me turn me into whatever the fuck you can. Well, we had people sign contracts. Like I wasn't, I wasn't bullshitting like you're going to sign away your soul. Um, but this is more like a jump into kind of um natural feeling. Um, get the you know jump into kind of thing where it wants it more like a real life kind of thing. The idea is that it's uh... So me and Scott have written an entire television series, 12 episode, uh, hour long sci-fi show. This is going to act as the foundation of what we're doing. The whole concept is crazy and I love it. Well, it's a really interesting prospect that we could possibly view our dreams on a screen. We are not entertained by movies anymore, so we're going to dive into your brain and watch all the crazy shit that you think about. It's so interesting, way cooler than like watching Mission Impossible 7. And kind of as a metaphor. The reality aspect is you want to know about the actor that's not just Yeah, the so we want to know about you, we want to know about oh, your experience on the like, project too. I guess I thought it was like a mockumentary kind of thing. It like kind of is, it kind part. of is, but it's based in reality. So it's interesting to see how a group of strangers interact with each other. Relationships are not that complicated if you work hard at it to not make it complicated. Focus on relationships because that's the only thing that's going to matter in the end. Sounds working Beep. good. Beep. Hey guys, everybody's here. So you think we should go ahead and get some introductions done? Okay, I'm Mark. <laughs> and I'm playing the character Sam. We conversated, we talked. Yeah. <laughs> All right. I'm Mike. Nice to meet you, Mike. Oh. Nice. <laughs> um, uh, I'm like, I'm yeah. playing Eamon. I'm a blowhard that talks too much, that, you know, thinks I'm the shit. I'm Phoebe. Uh, I'm playing Danny and Aubrey. Yeah, I'm weird. Yes, that's true. That's true. <laughs> I am Juan Montoya. Um, I actually forgot my character name. Here to shoot the Insight Company. Um, I'm Bridget. I'm <laughs> Playing Belle, who's a dreamer of horror. Dunno. I just go. I'm Lindsay. I'm playing Amy Tang. She's the like, sweet little girl. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Lindsay. I'm playing Amy Tang. She's the like, CEO, I think, of one of the major dream companies. I'm snobby. <laughs> um, my name is Mara, and overall, I'm playing the drama dreamer. I'm like kind of nuts and like. I like to party. I'm, <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, oh, you're good. Um, I was pretty deflated about that. I'm playing with Corey. And, uh, I guess I run shit. Hi, I'm Terry. Terry. 
And I'm playing Debbie, who's Eamon's wife and Bro's mom. Um, very positive, very positive impression of the show. Uh, I'm Gary, and I'm playing Ro, uh, who's the 16 year old uh, dreamer that's uh, discovered. Like, not anywhere where I'm that guy who can like come into a room and just like be himself and talk to people. Like definitely not. Uh, I'm Jeff Darren, um, playing Scout. This project deserves better than the people that are currently involved in it. I include myself. 